Oh, this is a message to all friends. No, I'm joking. Hiya, it's me in the little wood, also known as Martin, and after five long years with the gamer tag DJ Martin, I'm laying it to rest. And I'm using in the little wood as my new tag. Thought I'd let you all know. Bye! Hello everybody, I'm in the little wood, also known as Martin, and welcome back to Jet Set Radio Future. So today, right on, uh, today I'm playing as Corn. I thought I'd change it up a little bit to just kind of show off the characters. They really don't feel that different, but meh, he's the leader of the GG, so why not? And uh, I'm really happy that I'm getting to do this Let's Play. I mean, I, it's kind of not... I don't know, it's weird, I'm making it sound like it's not my choice, but, um, you know, I'd only do it if people were watching. And granted, not as many people are watching this as my normal series, but the comments and everything are just as high as the usual video. So I know the people that are watching it are really, really into it. Like, you are responding and, ah, it's, it's so cool. So, uh, if you're a sapling that's not just here for Minecraft, then you are awesome and I love you. Hi. Uh, so we've got to go around and cover up all of this graffiti because, damn, poison jams left it everywhere. Right, there we go. <laughs> All the comments on the last video as well. Also, I was started or ended with the word damn. It was, <laughs> it made me laugh. It was funny. Right, there we go. Uh, let's go across this and have a little hop. And there we go. Right, let's come off there. Now, cans in this area are sometimes hard to come by. And there's quite a few graffiti souls already naturally spawned in this area as well. Uh, so I'll tell you what, let's go find a graffiti soul while we stock up on cans. I'm trying to remember where the first graffiti soul is. I don't think it's... Oh yeah, there's one that's on top of that bush shelter. So if I go over to here... Oh, I'm stuck with you. Oh, steady! Jesus Christ, good thing they've got good brakes in this. I would be so dead otherwise. Right, here we go. Now, when I did this on the live stream a week or two ago, this took me about four attempts. I'm going to get it in one. I'm going to get it in one. Yes! You got graffiti soul! Right, there we go. Sorted. Play Tremets, ladies and gentlemen. Right, some little wonder around here. What have we got? Now, in this area, you unlock a guy who's got a giant boom box, which is amazing. So you'll see him uh, as soon as we've covered up all the graffiti and we've gotten rid of Poison Jam. Because uh, you have to. You don't race Poison Jam in this area. Um, but in the next area, I think it's called. I think it's called Cho Street. Um, you have to race Poison Jam, all three of them, all the way around the place. Uh, which is quite cool. It's quite intense sometimes if you're not doing too well. Right, let's have a little wander over here. I'm really tempted not to boost. But I know if I do, then I'm going to be losing my cans that I need for graffiti. Uh, let's have a go over here. Oh, by the way, if anybody uh, still submits fan art and stuff, you can still do that through the Facebook page and everything. And it's been one of my things ever since I was little to have like an amazing artistic piece of me as a Jet Set Radio character but obviously in the past I never knew what my character would look like but now I do so I mean I'll put some links in the description to pieces of art that I was kind of hoping to get of the same level um, and if you know somebody who does it even for a commission I will I will pay them because <laughs> I would love to have a piece like that you got graffiti soul yes there we go uh, where are all the other pieces so for people that are new to this map there we go I can rotate it downwards now so, obviously this branches out to a lot of the levels in the game. All the orange dots are, um, are pieces of graffiti that need covering up. And the dark orange one is actually a graffiti soul. Uh, so, if I go... Where was it? Okay, there's a few down here on some bus, on some actual buses themselves. There we go. Oh, careful. There we go. Right. Oh, I love this song. I'm going to say that every time a song comes out in this series, but, but yeah. Oh yeah! Bam, 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 bam. This one's called uh, "I Love Love You." I think it's called. A lot of the titles are very, very easy to guess. Like there's one that's called "Like This, Like That" because those are like the only words they say in the whole song. So, uh, so yeah. And there we go, medium piece. Let's have a little wander around here. You love, 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 love. You love me. Love, love, love you. See what I mean? But it's just the very minimalistic songs, but they're really amazing as well. It's like club songs. You know, like club songs are always just like, you know, bounce. Boo -doo -doo. It's just like that. It's awesome. Right. Now, normally I try and grind along all of these to catch them, but I don't see it happening, to be fair. There we go. Any more left? Four more left. We've got two over here. Ah, we've got the big ones. Okay. 
Stani! Right, we go around here. Oh, what? Hello? Oh, there we go. <laughs> As I stuck for a minute here, I had no idea what was going on. Right, here we go. Baby! Baby! Right, one, two, three. Nearly done. Got a few more to get. I'll tell you what, let's go get that graffiti soul. Um, I don't remember how you get that one. Or do I? Oh. I swear it's... Oh, it is behind the boxes. That's alright, okay. Never mind. Ignore me. I know exactly where it is. You have to go up here. And all the way across. Now, in the last episode, a lot of people were saying that they wanted to see me unlock every character in the game. Which will be pretty easy. Um, but probably what I'll do is I'll go through the whole game and unlock all the ones that you get just from playing the game normally. And then what, I, what I'll do is I'll go back and I'll show you how you have to get certain, like, you know, you have to grind across certain things without touching the floor and all the other bits uh, to actually unlock graffiti souls. Um, and then that will actually lead to you unlocking more characters. So, so yeah, there's a guy in the game. I can't remember what his name's called. You might have to have a do a bit of research for me. Uh, but he's a guy who's got red dreadlocks. <laughs> he's one of our favourite characters, though. I'm tempted to say he was called Chuck, but I, I could be wrong. Right. Damn! Poison jam! Right, so I've got to go find them now. They are the blue dots on the map, so they will be over this way. Right, here we go. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Oh. Bugger. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, careful. Right, there we go. Across we go. Ah, there they are. Wicked. How many? I swear there was three of them. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> they suddenly lost the member. <laughs> oh, God. Poison Jam's voice is going to hurt me, isn't it? I think we're okay, though, because I don't think they ever actually say anything. They just go... <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> it's very strange. There's a golden tape just around there as well, actually, up on this point. So, I don't remember where all the golden tapes are, to be honest. I only know very few. Um... So I wouldn't rely on this Let's Play too much for actually telling you where everything is. Because <laughs> I don't remember half of this myself. Right, oh, there we go. And nailed it. Right, I tell you what, just before they run off, let me just grab the golden tape. There we go. Oh, no, don't spray you can. It's killing the environment. What do you think you're doing, corn? <laughs> God. Oh, wait until you see Poison Jam's leader. She's this, like, gothic-looking girl. And she's one of our favourite characters in the whole game. I have no idea what she's called, though. I think it's something dead generic, like Poison or something like that. It's weird. I think she might be called Raven or something. <laughs> it's very, um... Yeah, it's very default. Right, so I've got to go that way. Now, the thing is, is that you don't even have to... I'll show you, look. You don't even have to do all the grinding and stuff to get to them. You can literally just roll over to them, and that's fine. Um, there we go. Cross to here. And you just talk to them. So, it's kind of weird. I don't understand why they've made the game like that, but... Each to their own. Each to their own, indeed. Right, across we go. So, really, they've not gone anywhere. They've just gone up a level. If only there was a fly mod for Jet Set Radio. I bet there is by now. I bet someone's coded one by now. It's been like, what, 10 years, not if not more. <laughs> it's been a while. Right, there we go. Are you trying to muscle us around? No. Someone I don't really want to see is coming. I gotta go! Ow. <laughs> My poor throat. It's like doing Father Huni for two hours on the live streams. <laughs> Ouch. Oh yeah, I'm going to show my show my blue box, blue box, blah, 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 blah. His lips are massive, so I'm going to assume he's like Jay-Z, and he's just like, he can't talk. His lips are that big. You ready for the blubbering mess that is? Combo. Yo, kid, what's this? Who's been spraying these ugly tags on my turf? Oh, I'm guessing it was you. It's on. If you lose... You're gonna be answering to me from now on, punk. You think you could do this too? Let's see it. <laughs> Sorry. It's the most ridiculous voice acting ever. Right, so now this time I have to do exactly what he does. So I've got to grind across there, jump, grind again. Now if I remember, he goes around the loop, he jumps up onto the stairs, and then he comes down off the other end and stops. So he comes down here and... Yeah, he's breaking. Haha. Now the only thing with this one... Is that when you go over, um, 
there's actually a chance that you could, what's it called? You could actually um, overshoot it, because that's why he broke, because sometimes you go over it, and you start grinding on the next bit, and it won't count, which is really annoying. And... Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, yes! Oh yeah! Right, let me start breaking now. There we go. Skating along! See ya! Scared him away. Oh yeah. Hey! They're the, they're the ones who messed up the bus terminal. Oh, sorry for doubting you. No hard feelings, right? We're gonna be a team from now on. Brilliant. Awesome. Combo has joined you. Oh, for God's sake. HQ to all squads. There are reports of youth skating near Shibuya Terminal. No, it's a lie. All units in the area, please investigate. Repeat. All units. Uh... What? Another police shakedown? These cops have been busting people like nobody's business. Well, I'm gonna bounce over to the garage and bounce. <laughs> if you're gonna stick around and take them on, watch out for the crazy captain. Right, okay. So combo's off, and the captain is a new character you're gonna meet. Uh, why is it so hard for you to catch a few little punks? Hurry up and arrest them! Right, now keep in mind, I've only got spray cans. This guy is bringing a gun to a graffiti fight. How is that fair? <laughs> on, on, on any level? It's a bit brutal, isn't it? Just for rolling around on some wheeled shoes. It's very, very harsh. Oh, there goes the boss. Now, the boss has about twice as much health as the other guys do, if not more. So, if I just go around here... I don't even know where the boss has gone, actually. Right, there we go. The only thing in this game is, actually, when you're, when you're spraying graffiti, your camera angles go very, very weird. But, I don't know, it's kind of something that you kind of learn to love and you kind of learn to get used to. Oh, by the way, I forgot to show you that, actually. If you grind, it will actually, um, it will take the enemies off your tail. Like, if they've got a hold of you. And... He's done. That's the boss done. Just got to take out a few little cronies now. There we go. Oh, look at that. I was talking to uh, Wangles about this game the other day. And he said to me, he goes, it's a very camp game, isn't it? And I was like, what do you mean? It's it's like awesome. It's kick-ass. He was like, well, no, because you're, you're going around on roller skates. And you're um, and you're painting, you're painting pretty pictures. I was like, oh, come on now. <laughs> Give me a break. Right, there we go. We're done. Oh, my back! I can't do his voice, it's way too high. <laughs> I just might have to resort to my Professor Oak voice, which I discovered the other day, which was very strange, but that's all good. Whenever you're done loading, there we go. Oh. The station feared and revered by both man and our beast. Jet Set Radio! Citizens of the underworld, this is your king speaking. Stop what you're doing and listen up. Seems that Poison Jam graffiti contains a lethal poison. Makes people laugh themselves to death. They followed up their performance oh my at the terminal with encores at Chuo Street and in Rakaku Dai Heights. Right. Those Poison Jam punks got as much attitude as they are ugly. <clears throat> and Poison Jam has been heating up the streets with their rivalry with the Queens and 99th Street. The Rabbit 99! These ladies hate seafood with a passion and fight with those fish faced fools. Poison Jam, like cats and dogs. If you can find them out there in the streets, they might slip you some information. Oh god. And then Hayashi. Hayashi. The Rokaku. Look at his he's got own personal. He's got a colon free smiley, hasn't he? I mean, even his own partner is afraid of him. Because when he loses it, there ain't no telling who he'll shoot at. I mean, he's crazy. Check this out. Just the other day, he freaked out and trashed the patrol car. And why, you may ask? Your first game, baby. One of his subordinates went to buy him his favorite mint candy and came back with coffee flavored instead. I can understand that. I shoot someone if they brought me their own coffee or the wrong type of sweet. God damn it! I asked for a, a I asked for a double decker, and someone brought me a Twix. I went mad. Blood up, kid! I'm gonna play his combo. He, he's massive, isn't he? Look at him. Look at he's huge. I mean, it has to be pretty big to support that boombox, but still. Right, I tell you what, let's save quickly. Hey, up, row boy. Save game later. Right, I think we're gonna go to Cho Street because that's one of my favourite areas in the whole game. 
I think I have to go back into Shibuya Terminal first though. Uh, which is where exactly? I think it's over this way. Look, he may as well just be carrying this on his shoulders. Why not? He's big enough. Th those are like his iPod earphones. <laughs> That's all it is. Oh my god, there's a little dog. I've never seen the dog. Hold on, wait. Let me just have a little go over here. I never knew that there was a dog in this game. Oh, he's a little puppy. <laughs> he's got 3D glasses on. Oh, that is awesome. Have you got a naked picture of a dog in your kennel? No, it's not. You're okay. You're good. You're a good boy. What's inside here? Let me just go across here a little bit. Anything on the other wall? No, nothing. We're going to name you Asterix. Because that is what you've got on your kennel. That's I like that. Everybody meet Asterix. There we go. New character in the game. Right, let's head over to Shibuya Terminal. And then make our way over to Cho Street. Because that's how we roll. Right, where are we going? Um... Hey! Up the volume and wake up the neighbors. Are you hearing this? What? Is your heart pounding with the beat? Am I getting through to you? Show me what you got. I'm counting on y'all. I'm counting on y'all, baby. Uh, DJ Buzz Kevin. Who's in it? Right, we're through. Cho Street. Let's do it. This is Chuo Street, the heart of Tokyo's entertainment district. Now get out there and bury poison gems, nasty graffiti and paint. Let's do it. We got this. <laughs> 7,600. It's not quite over 9,000, but it's close. To all squads. A gang has been spotted near Chuo Street. All squads right, there we go. Repeat. I remember the save point is here. Oh. There we go. Oh. Thanks. Oh my, come on. Why are you bringing in tank? A gun was bad enough. Now you're bringing it. Oh my god. Right, I'm playing this gun. I don't like combo. He's a bit bulky. Right, save. Uh, save there. Right, let's do this. Jesus Christ. They're really not messing them out, are they? Yeah, a gang. Not a little girl on a rollerblade is going to work. I'm like Eliza Doolittle, just leave me to be. Oh, why is it repeating? That's strange. Right, here we go. Blast them! Right, here we go. Now, if I remember rightly, there's none. Yeah, there's no other ones up there. They're all just down on the right hand side. Excel. Hopefully I've got enough cans for that. Ah, just. Just about. Just about. Right, here we go. And across we go. Now there's actually a graffiti soul down there. So I'll tell you what, if I go back and get a can or two. Right, here we go. This is going to be difficult. I very rarely make this jump. It takes a few goes. Oh yeah! Yeah! Right, and then it should hopefully be around a corner somewhere. Aha! Oh, it's very close to the water. Right, there we go. Now, I don't know if I can actually get back from here. I mean, I'll give it a try, but I don't think it's possible. Up here. Some nice set of stairs. Right. Oh, I see. I can jump to there if I need to. Okay. Oh no, I'm fine, I'm good. Oh yeah. There we go. Let's head over this way. Nice little arch. And there's actually another graffiti soul really close by. Um, it's literally like, we'll see it in about two seconds. Just there. Nearly went off the edge there. <laughs> right, there we go. And you got graffiti soul. You got graffiti soul. Winning. I'm trying, I'm trying to see him. No, I'm on roller skates. I'm on roller skates. Right, right here we go. Right, so if we head up here. There we go. Now, there's a little area down here in a minute, which I absolutely love. Because it's basically you just grind all the way through it. And it's a bloody long stretch. Like, you grind along a rail. You come off a billboard. You do the same thing over and over again. And I think, actually, once you've completed the area and you go back and do it, it unlocks a graffiti soul somewhere. Oh, steady on, Professor Layton. You've got lots of puzzles to be solved. You shouldn't be on Chuo Street. <laughs> right, here we go. So, yeah, when you go down here, there's about... Is it eight of these? So, that's two. Three, four, 
five, six. Oh no, there's only six. Okay, now if I can do this perfectly. Ah, oh, sometimes you can grind all the way through there and get all the way back to the starting area as well. Oh, I haven't shown any half pipe jumps yet. Look at that. There you go. There's actually no graffiti through there, so uh, if I go this, whoa, that was pretty good. That was a pretty good jump actually. Well done, Gum. Right, there we go. A couple more pieces. And then, if I just turn around a little bit. Was that an octopus leg? What is that all? Oh my god. This game just gets more and more ridiculous. It really does. Right, there we go. I'm already dealing with fish people. And apparently we've got, like, Japanese girls who don't like sushi or they don't like fish food. How does that make any sense? Surely that's the one stereotype. Reptar! <laughs> Does that not look like Reptar out of the Rugrat series? Well, kind of not. But yeah, that's one of my favourite things in this whole game is that giant dinosaur. It's wicked. Right, spray a couple of these. There we go. Although, to be fair, that little dinosaur has nothing on the dragon uh, that's on 99th Street. So good. Right, spray away a couple of these. Let's have a little wonder over here. And there we go. See, in the first two or three areas, there's a lot of graffiti to do. Whereas when you move in throughout the game, uh, there's actually less and less. Just because the areas get more and more difficult to get to. Um, so that's pretty cool. Right, if I go up here. I think there's a cassette tape. Is it under? Oh, no, it's underneath it. There it is. Bam. I don't know what the cassette tapes do. Does anybody know? If you could tell me, that would be like a massive help. Right, up we go. And a bit of grinding. And we're off again. Right. Now there's graffiti on both sides, so I'll have to come back up the stairs. Oh, come on, man! Give me a break. Right. No. Damn! They brought in the tanks! Right. Oh, you know what I'm going to say, don't you? I love this song. My job. You carry it yourself so well. I made myself a promise that I would finally talk to her. As I remain stable, I take another glance at you. Oh, come on, I'm getting tail whipped. There we go. Tank use tail whip. It's super effective. And in my lonely eyes, I'm like, oh, oh, what is going on here? Hold on. Ah, there we go. And then you have to get the driver as well. There we go. I want to hold your hand. I haven't been the same man since I saw you coming in. Let's have a toast to the girl in aisle 10. Right, there we go. And he, now the driver has a gun as well. There we go. Got him. We're all good. How many have they brought in? Six. Really? Six tanks. Well, I suppose there are four of us. You shine in the neon sign. Right, there we go. Sorry, I'm so into the soundtrack. This song's called Isle 10. Um, it's one of the few songs that actually has, like, proper songwriting and lyrics in it, which is quite nice. Right, here we go. Uh, three tanks left to go, and then I think Hayashi actually spawns on top of a building with his gun and all sorts. Whoa! Ah, you can never touch me! La 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 la! <laughs> oh, what? Cut that, cut that. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, let me move forward. There we go. And the driver's out of there. You're done! Right, there we go. There's another tank just down here. There it is. What colour do tanks appear on this? Purple. That's interesting. There we go. And just the one more to go. It couldn't be further away, though, could it? You're standing by the car, Pia. I made myself a promise that I would finally talk to her. Oh! Tank's taking me down. Come on! I'm redecorating. Leave me be. Ah! Oh. You don't get this on the 60 minute makeover, do you? There we go. How about or anything that looks pretty will just now shoot with tanks. America's next top model. Shoot them with a tank. You know, kittens. Get them in a bucket. Shoot them with a tank. Uh, what else is pretty? We want an Emma Watson shooter with a tank. That's a quote, isn't it? <laughs> Jesus. Right, let's go up here. Um, now, there's two ways I can get there. Oh, my God, I'm hurt. Oh, God. Do you want to recover? 
You, you take a minute. Are you like, oh god, I, I feel really bad for her. She's been fighting tanks, for god's sake. Now she's got to face a dude with a gun. Oh, she's just lolling about it. LOL! I've been shot by a tank, LOL! Whoa! Oh. Oh, get off, man! Oh! Oh god, I fell. I need cans, I need cans. I don't think I've ever actually died on this game. I no, I don't think I've ever died. I didn't even know it was possible. It's the first time I've ever seen one of them injured in my life. There we go. Oh yeah! Done. Here we are. Cool. Uh, Mike, Mike, Mike. Right, there we go. Large piece. We've got a few more pieces left to get. And then we're... Oh, is that all of that graffiti piece done? Right, now I need to get over to that there. That graffiti thing. How do I get to that again? That graffiti soul. Um, tell you what, let me just get some health. I miss... Oh! No! That's the first time in my entire life on this game that I've ever died. I think. Pretty sure that's the first time ever. Does it... Do I have to do that whole area again? You've got to be having a giraffe. Please. Please, no. Please, no. Oh, you are having a bubble! Right. Okay. <laughs> I tell you what, we're going to fast forward. We're going to go back to where we were because I'm not making you watch all that again. Okay, so I'll be back in a moment. Okay, welcome back everybody. Um, <laughs> I had to do that all again, which was fun. Now, I'm thinking to go over to this graffiti soul over here. Yes, got it. Got it. Results. Right, let's have a wander up here then. We've only got a few more bits of uh, graffiti to cover up. All by Poison Jam. Loads of them on the left, and there's just one that's on the right-hand side up here. So, and then as soon as I clear up all of those, I think Poison Jam has to race me. And I think once we defeat them in that race, that's where we'll end today's video, which will be good. Uh, well, by the way, these videos are going to be daily, I think. These Jet Set Radio ones. And then I'm going to try and get a Minecraft Let's Play started as well. Uh, but the problem is, is like, we've got 1.8, but then 1.9 pre-release is out. So do I play on that, or 1.8? But then 1.9 officially will come out, and it's just why I've not done one so far. Because I haven't... I feel like I'll start on one world, and then, you know, a new version will come out. And I want to make sure that I have everything. Like, you know, I have ravines, I have never ruins and you know all sorts like that oh my god i'm out of cans oh come on oh i have to climb back up again hold on a minute where are some cans i need a refill refill uh there should be some over here actually let's have a little wander over here now i think these things over here um, are health that's what i was trying to get to before before i got hit by the car <laughs> I have, a, I have a habit of getting hit by cars. I should probably do a montage, actually, by the end of this Let's Play of, like, all the times. I've never seen that before. Sorry, I get so easily distracted. Like, ooh, shiny. I've never seen that before in my entire life. That's awesome. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. Taking home the jackpot. Let's just hope that happens when I go to Minecon. Because I think there's a casino in the hotel, so I'm hoping that I, uh... I get to I get to win a jackpot or something. That'd be amazing. Right, there we go. And we just got one more piece of graffiti on the opposite end. Am I the only one who thinks it's a bit harsh like this game? This game's, you know, for everybody, for kids. And people are laughing themselves to death when they breathe in the toxins of the poison jam stuff. It's just a bit... I don't know. I think it's quite dark, isn't it? Well, I suppose there's, other, there's a lot harsher ways to die. They're not saying they're bleeding from the ears or anything. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da! Graffiti cleared. Oh, she got blue knickers on. That's right. I do have Looks blue like knickers on. Ah! Have Please don't feed the animals. Please don't feed the animals. Right. We got plenty of cans, so I can boost my way ahead of them at the start of the race. Let's give them a chat. Here we go. You want to get rid of us, don't you? Nothing in life is free. You gotta work for it. Beat right, us in a race, and we won't mess with you anymore. <laughs> Next thing you know, you'll be all crying like a baby. Right, let's go. Once again, I love this song. 
Bubble Bop Go! Oldie but a goodie. This song's called Oldie but Goodies. So there you go. Kind of obvious from the words he's just said. That's just plain poppycock. Right, there we go. I should be well ahead of them. Oh, actually I'm not. Okay, maybe they're tougher than I remember. <laughs> right, here we go. Across the very weird face, through the burger flimping sign, and we're through. We're good. Okay, I'm starting to distance a little bit from them. Not quite safe yet. Right, now I'm just worried about this water over here. Because if I fall in any of it, that's it. We're done. We're done! Oh, yeah! Okay, we're good. There we go. And we're almost the cr oh, I nearly made it across. Right, let's boost all the way through here. I've got to be flying ahead now, surely. Surely, surely, surely. Oh, there's Professor Layton again. We should see how many Professor Laytons are spotted in each episode. If we do that on the next episode, just keep an eye out for them and see how many you manage to see. That I think that could be quite good. Right, here we go. And up there for that can. And have a little boost. A defo well ahead of them. Whoa! Okay. They've only just entered this, like, archy, swirly snake area. That's good. Badam, bam, boom. Across to here. And we have... Oh, nearly got it. Right, there we go. We'll take the shortcut away. Across to there. Let's try and grind all the way through this area. There we go. And hopefully, if I can reach it, I can grind off that little billboard over there. And yeah, there we go. There we go. And I think we've completed it. Oh, you win! One minute forty-one. Blue knickers. That's right. Oh, that's pathetic, man. You won't get us that easy. Right, they're off. Poison gems out of control in Rakakuda Heights. Go tell my baby! Right, so there we go. That is everything. We are going to head over to Rokokudai Heights, and I shall see you all tomorrow for the next episode.